When most people think of flowers, they envision roses, daisies, or perhaps a bouquet of vibrant tulips. But have you ever heard of a flower so large it could double as an umbrella on a rainy day and with a fragrance that might just remind you of last week's trash? Introducing the Rafflesia. a truly unique plant that can only be found in the rainforests of Southeast Asia. Particularly in Indonesia, Malaysia, Thailand and the Philippines. Compared to your typical plant, the Rafflesia is weird and wacky in a number of ways. The Rafflesia holds the title for the world's largest flower, with some species boasting a diameter of over three feet. Impressive, but wait till you hear about its party trick. This isn't the kind of flower you'd want in your Valentine's bouquet. Rafflesia flowers emit an aroma reminiscent of, well, let's just say it's a mix between overripe blue cheese and your gym socks after a marathon. Why, you ask? This odorous strategy is not to offend your senses, but to attract its best buddies, flies. The powerful stench draws in carrion flies, which, thinking they've hit the jackpot with a rotting meal, land on the Rafflesia flowers. As they wander around, disappointed that it's just a tricky flower and not a feast, they inadvertently pick up pollen and deposit it on other Rafflesia flowers in the area, helping the Rafflesia reproduce. But there's another interesting fact when it comes to reproduction. Rafflesia flowers are dioecious, meaning that individual flowers are either male or female. For successful pollination, flies need to visit a male flower first to pick up pollen and then subsequently visit a female flower to deposit the pollen. Given the rarity of Rafflesia blooms and the short period in which they are open, usually just a few days, successful pollination can be quite a challenge. Now, if you're considering adding this to your garden collection, there's a bit of a hitch. The Rafflesia is a parasitic plant, lacking roots, leaves or stems. Instead, it latches onto a host plant to draw nutrients, making it quite the freeloader of the floral world. Nature truly has its quirks, and the Rafflesia stands as a testament to the weird, wacky and wonderfully smelly wonders of the plant kingdom. Okay, time for that quick quiz. Don't forget to subscribe!